with Virgin Galactic. We all can't wait for the Paseo del Norte interchange to be complete. It's close, but the goal of having the flyover up and running by October didn't happen. Action 7 News reporter Regina Reese spoke to the project engineer. She joins us with those details. Shelly, right now the project is 85% complete. The completion date is set for December 20th. If that deadline isn't met, the contractor could end up dishing out big bucks. Piece by piece, the Paseo del Norte flyover is coming together. From Sky 7, you can see it will be the fast, easy way for drivers to zip from I-25 northbound to Paseo del Norte heading west. There was hopes that maybe we could get uh, get the flyover ready by uh, Balloon Fiesta, but but it didn't, you know, it didn't happen. Delays from a lot of summer rain and moving utilities around hampered the speedy process a bit, but it doesn't look like the ultimate deadline of December 20th will be affected. It looks like it will be made. I think that the, the contractor is on schedule, as we said, and I don't see any major issues right now. The contractor has an obligation to finish on time, or else what's called liquidated damages go into effect. They're, uh, uh, a specific dollar amount that the contractor pays if they do not finish by the, the contract date that they're supposed to finish. In the case of the Paseo del Norte project, that dollar amount is $50,000 every single day the project goes past December 20th. At this point, drivers aren't the only ones anxious for completion day. <laughs> it will be a big relief. Uh, it will be a big relief. It's been a lot of work and a lot of hours. Right now, the main construction that needs to be finished on the flyover is the concrete deck and the barrier railing. Back to you. The project cost is $75 million and paid for by city, county, state, and federal money.